the Panopticon. Looks like we need to get up to the fourth floor. And we have some dead bodies, so I'll just go ahead and use them right now. Or some of them anyway. Do a little force choke on you. There you go. How you doing? Floaty floaty, floaty McFloatster. Aw, our friend is dead. That's alright, we can have a new friend. How you doing? We have a new friend! I feel good about things now. So apparently the Benikoff TV is uh, up. It's, uh, it's rampaging, I believe was maybe the word that was used. I don't remember. So I'm just kind of wondering, thanks for that. If we're supposed to be going upstairs or downstairs, I'm going to guess maybe we're going downstairs, not upstairs. When we say fourth floor, we mean uh, lower, not not higher, but maybe not. I'll kind of wander around this way first. Oh, hello. Hello, mail drop box. Does make me curious what that one's about. What do we have over here? Hello. Picnic basket. Again. Wonder what that one's about. What do we have over here? Standing fan. Okay. I bet that one uh, can do something interesting. Want to be Mjolnir. Okay. Excellent. So we're on fire break, and apparently we do want to go upstairs by the looks of things. Archives redacted AI containment. And then P6 cell is upstairs. So all that time that I spent wandering over this way means we now have to backtrack. So we can go back downstairs. Is there anything out here? I mean, this just looks like maybe there could be something here. Yeah, I'm going to die. That's fine. I guess you're not really supposed to be wandering around over there. That's fine. Whatever. I'm not going to hold any grudges. Do let us go downstairs, though. And see if there's anything of interest over here. I'm going to guess if we go far enough, we'll find uh, maybe a chest or something. Then again, maybe not. Maybe not. Yeah, there's one. See, I knew we'd find one. Got ourselves a remote thought. Exciting. All right, let's go. I'll meet you. I was going to say I'd meet you at the elevator, but I guess we got a, a big old fight to do. So let's do the fight thing. Let's fire up Fight Club. On one. Friends. Just kidding. Not really friends. Just in case you're going to drop something, you might as well do it now. Okay. Off to the elevator. Bureau's plan to make Dylan the next director. Marshall made it sound like it was all Dylan's fault, but how much of it was what the Bureau did to him? I don't think she's telling me everything. I wonder if to get up we have to go down, or to get down we have to go down, or something. I don't know, just one of those things. I, I find it curious we're skipping two floors. We can see the P6 cell up there. We know we have friendlies over here. Or unfriendlies. This room appears to be empty, but it may not be around this place. You never know. Just saying. Watch 
this object at all times, or it deviates. My ship replacement never showed up. Can you help me? Damn. I can't, I'm sorry. There's an emergency. I'll come back, I promise. Okay, okay, just don't forget. I can't stare at this thing much longer. Wow. Um... This sounds kind of interesting to me, actually. So let's do this first. Okay. We can't get in the room over here. So what do we have to do? Find him someone to come watch? Guess we have to find his uh, shift replacement. After Dylan has been found. Got it. Okay. So I guess we can put our missions... Um, maybe go back to that one. Since it doesn't seem like we can go assist uh, Philip just yet. Sorry, Philip. We'll be a minute. I'll try and go fast, but... Uh, probably going to be a minute. There's definitely some fighting going on. I guess this is probably the better choice, is to use a Disa gun. I wonder if I'd be better off using the sniper rifle on these dudes. Or the sniper pistol. Oh, I think I shot... just missed him with that one round, and he was so close. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that, too. This dude's like, hey, I, I'm feeling... I'm feeling froggy. I'm gonna come back and, uh, see if I can help out. All right, buddy. Don't die. I might need you to go help out Philip, so just be careful. There we go. Join the good team. Join the good team. And let's just watch you for a second because you're about to fall out of the sky. And plummet. Three, two, one, go! Thanks. You're very green and shiny. Just saying. So, did your friend survive? Or did your friend die? I guess your friend is dead, but uh, you never know. Eh, look at that. You are alive down here. If I could give you some health or something, I would, but... I can't, so don't die. Hi, guys. Kaboom! Kaboom and stuff. You're still alive. Look at you. Come over here and collect these health pickups. Maybe you can figure out how to do something with them. Oh, it looks like we're going into something bad. We are going into something bad. This is what we saw in the last episode. I think this body here was uh, kind of blocking the way. I mean, if one's going to block the way, might as well add another. Twisted Passage. That's the object of power. I need to cleanse it.
Hmm. That doesn't seem like that worked. And, um... What is going on here? This is... This is not at all right. <laughs> this is not right at all. Holy moly, man. What is going on here? Everything got turned on its side, and yet not everything got turned on its side. This is wild. This is wild. And then look at this. Oh, man. Holy cow. It has friends. The TV has friends. Oh. Uh, I guess we gotta go get in the room to trigger the fight and you look like a boss. If I had to guess. Here we go. Let's do the thing. Salvador! Eh, we never did meet him, did we? I guess we have now. Where'd you go? Get rid of his friends here first. That way we build up a little bit of... health we can... ideally take at some point here. Well, that was doing good damage there. Can we convert you? Uh, it's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. Okay. Whew. Shield up in time. We're good. Yeah, we have that armor piercing going on. And, um... Oh, crap. Um, this is why we have health flying around everywhere. Air. Um, hi. Excuse me. Where are you? You're not who I thought you were. Or not who I wanted you to be. Whatever. You? No, not you. But I will convert you. That's fine. I'll give us a meat shield as far as I'm concerned. There we go. Oh, we had a thing to kill a thing. Look at that. And we did the thing. Ow. That thing was Salvador, the head of security. His team didn't stand a chance against the Hiss. No one here does. Except Jesse. Go figure. This whole room is, oh my gosh. What the crap is happening? Wow. Well, we successfully killed, I guess, Salvador, who had already been killed by the Hiss, effectively. So, bully for us, let's go check out the TV here. Okay, the TV. But before we do that... Uh, why did you go to a different thing? Anchor sup supplement. Easy for me to say. Ocelot's anchor. The crew of the White Ocelot first encountered a strange spherical phenomenon while fishing in the Redacted. Witnesses described it as a black sphere with faint light behind it. It hovered just off the bow of the ship, the crew redacted by throwing a tin bucket which disappeared into the sphere. Soon after, the vessel lost structural integrity. The ship's metal rusted and fell apart within minutes. As the ship sank, the sphere lowered into the water. A passing, a, a passing fishing vessel called the Redacted rescued the four surviving crew. Agents were dispatched to the White Ocelot's last known coordinates, Redacted, and began diving operations. On the ocean floor, the agents found the sphere. The ship was entirely destroyed except for its anchor. As agents lifted the anchor off the ocean floor, they noticed the sphere behaved in conjunction with the anchor, moving and stopping as one. Contact with the sphere was avoided, but handling the anchor proved harmless. The item was transported by the Redacted to the U.S. Port of Redacted, 
Upon arriving in New York, it was brought into the Bureau via the Redacted. This is located on Floor 3, Unit 7, within the Panopticon. So maybe we'll get a chance to see this at some point? I don't know. Let's go interact with the TV, because that is why we are in fact here. Use Levitate to complete the Astral Plane Challenge. Hold space to levitate. Ooh. I think I like this. I think I like this very much. Oh, wow. Look at that. So, can we... We can do that. I mean, I was kind of wondering if we would get a chance to double jump to levitate whatever based on the uh, thingy majigger, the black rock quarry. How you doing? All right. I don't know why I'm stopping to fight these guys. There's clearly no reason to do this. It just seemed like it might be fun. I gotta say, man, the armor piercing on this gun was clutch in the fight against Salvador. I was able to do a bunch of damage that way. That was very nice. So I'm gonna guess we're supposed to go up. Oh! Nope. I, I did a bad... Um, what am I doing here? Okay. Do the floaty thing. I don't know why you're not doing the floaty thing. Alright, we'll just bypass everyone, because... Oh, okay. Apparently we can still... Shoot while floating. That's good to know. Didn't mean to do that. That should be fine. Okay. Dealt with the TV. Now I can find Dylan. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take a wild, wild guess and say we go back that way. And the way we get back there is we float. But because I'm a jerk, I want to go this way. And then see how long it takes to die. Apparently we are just going to reach a wall at some point here. One ability point gained, but why? Did I discover a secret area? I don't think I did. But if I did, excellent. I definitely like having the ability to, I won't say fly, but the ability to levitate, pretty cool. Hidden location discovered. When? We literally came through this way, so I don't think it's that one. Maybe it was back in there, I don't know. Because I think that is indeed why we got an extra ability point. Well, whatever. Let us... Levitate. And then levitate some more. I like that you can keep levitating and that your energy will regenerate while you're doing so. That is very handy. Let's get some bullet energy back. I thought I saw someone on this side, but it might be someone that we cannot throw things at. If that's the case, that's fine. I knew we couldn't throw that at you and have it actually hit you. Not worried. Hmm. Just move real quick here. Move quickly. Whatever.
Buddy. Can I just go ahead and convert you? Save me some trouble. You're going to be useless against the other flying guy. Because you're just going to throw stuff at him and he's going to dodge. Or you're going to cheat and you're going to actually hit him and I'm going to be upset. I mean, grateful, but upset. Which is it? Bye now. Oh. Brr. So, there was a thing you could do. Didn't mean to do that. My bad. I just wanted to jump. So you can float your way down. Okay. So you don't have to just do the dodge thing before you land. You can just go ahead and float on down. Well, now I'm confused because this does not appear to be the way to go. If this was the way we came in. Well, I don't know where to go now. How do we return to the Panopticon? Ah, oh, there's a hallway down here. Of course there is. Of course there is. So that's where we came through. I guess I was confused. Search for Dylan in the maximum security cells. Fifth floor. Now, if I recall, what are you doing over there? You're going to be stranded. Why are you over there? Oh, see, can we get all the way over there now? Oh, I have questions. I have questions that I want to know if there are answers. Yep, we can get over here. Look at that. I don't think we can get over here any other way than to do that. Because we would have unlocked these if we already had access to them, I would think. Unless this is where Philip is. Nope. No Philip. Yeah, see, we're behind a door. Excellent. Can we unlock that door? Sure can. We sure can, which means that we can then, I believe, go take the elevator up to the fifth floor. Or maybe we just have to fly. Oh, that's how we get down to the other floors. We can just float our way down. Float on up, or float on down. Oh, and we do have stuff that we can do. We have a new weapon form available, perhaps. Nope, we just have upgrades available. Uh, no, we do have a new weapon charge. We, have con we can construct charge. Let us do it. We have constructed charge. We'll have to play with that one. And then we can upgrade uh, most everything else. We just don't have the materials, so minor details and stuff. And we do have enough ability points that we could put a few points... Oh, look at that. We can put points into levitate. Press C while levitating to slam into the ground and damage nearby enemies. Well, that sounds delightful. But I was kind of thinking of doing, like... I don't know, maybe the shield stuff, but I kind of like levitating better. Ground slam, ground slam, ground slam. That all sounds very fun. Launch enemies. That really sounds like a good time, too. More more enemy launching I'm in. Launching large objects. I mean, come on. Oh, man. Paralyzed by the tyranny of choice. I think what I'm going to do is uh, ignore all of those. We can do... Oh, well, that's right. We can turn this in. So we got a new shield efficiency mod. That was for one of the uh, countermeasures that we had. And we still have other ones going on. Kill enemies with the service weapon in charge mode. I guess we'll go ahead and take that. I mean, it's going to be a crap reward, but we'll go ahead and do it. That's fine. Kill enemies in the containment sector using abilities. Yeah, that's going to be easy because most of the time I think I just throw things at people and call it good. That, that tends to be how I roll. Although, some bullets, or pseudo bullets, aren't a bad thing. For right now, we're going to call this one good. We will catch up on the next one as we either float down or float up or do a little bit of both. Catch that one, till and Thanks for watching. See you later.